Hi everyone! So today's video is going to be my favorite products for the month of February and I have a lot of good stuff to show you guys that I've been testing for over a month at least most of them um, so I'm going to start by body care I guess and it's this awesome balm, uh, body balm moisturizer from this company called Rock and their little, um, I guess the little saying that they go it's we keep our promises and um, I swear they do this um, this moisturizer is called multi regenerating body balm and it claims to firm smooth string and nourish your skin for 24 hours and it's for skin that are very dry and damaged um, since I came home from vacation like probably two months ago I've been, uh, my skin have been extra dry and almost cracky and damaged with this, by the sun. So I've been, my only moisturizer that I've tried was uh, Vaseline, the company Vaseline. And I never had any problem until then. My, even if I apply two, three times a day, my skin would get super cracky and dry and almost flaky at the end of the day. And uh, I tried to use baby oil, aloe vera oil to moisture, moisturize it and nothing works. And until I tried this um, cream from Rock, um, my skin got baby smooth the, the day that I applied it. And I swear it lasts the whole day until I wash it off. And even in, when the next day when I, I'm in the shower and I wash it off, I can still feel that it's like still working and still in my skin that's how thick this the, this cream is I'm just gonna tr show it to you guys it's like this white thick cream that smells really fruity um, I love how it smells it goes on your skin um, pretty thick you don't need that much because you'll see that it spreads very easily without that greasy feel that's the most important part for me it um, it soaks your skin in, into your skin very, very fast. So this is a must for me right now, uh, especially in winter. So if you have the same problem as me, I would suggest you guys to try this because I think it retails for $25 at any drugstore. Um, but I got mine on sale for like $9. So, you know, this product can, you know, if you can catch it on sale, I would suggest you guys to get it. Uh, next is my shampoo and conditioner that I've been using for over, I want to say until, uh, for a good five months. Um, because it's probably like the fourth or the fifth bottle that I go through. And it's this Pantene color expression, no, brunette expression, the shampoo and conditioner. And it says that it's a daily color enhancing shampoo with liquid crystal and you can see the little I guess crystal in the shampoo here and um, I love how this make my hair color um, it does really enhance your hair color especially um, for dark hair and brunette like uh, like me um, I find that it get it makes my hair a little bit lighter and it gives that hint of like that reddish healthy brown color like sunkissed hair um, when I use this and I guess the first month that you use this you don't really notice anything different but I've been using it for a long time and I can see that it does um, enhance the color a lot and it makes my hair a lot browner without that without the need to um, color my hair so this is a great product that you can get at Walmart for like seven dollars each bottle so I've been loving this um, next is this little lip balm that I got um, from my I think my glossy box last month and it's from Elizabeth Grant skincare moisturizing stick and I've been using this a lot ev like practically every day three times a day whenever I feel my lips is chopped I love this um, I love how it feels when you apply it 
it's very moisturizing the only thing that i don't like is that it's that it doesn't last a long time so you need to reapply it a lot but it feels so good on my lips that i don't mind and i'm like almost like half way there already so i've been loving that um next is this Mm, this BB cream that I've been trying out for I want to say more than a month and it's from Marcel it's a drugstore company from uh, Canada and it's their first BB cream my tint is uh, medium to dark and uh, they only have two shades uh, light to medium and medium to dark and this claims to um, I guess uh, to enhance and moisturize your skin and makes it even I guess um, it's hypoallergenic so um, it's you know for people that have sensitive skin it's good um, I it, it says also that it will uh, like when you apply it it will adapt your skin tone which I find that it kind of does but I don't see someone that is like a lot darker than me that would be able to use this because sometimes I find that it kind of makes my skin a little bit lighter but um you know otherwise this BB cream is uh, have been replacing my um, Estee Lauder day wear it's a lot more affordable it's like 20 to 16 dollars right now in the in different drugstore um, I'm gonna do a full review on this I'm going to show you how I apply and all that stuff and it's extremely easy. All I need to do is one pump and I use my finger to apply it and I have it on today. Um, and I find that it's a very good alternative for people that doesn't like to wear foundation and um, and just like to have like, you know, a nice even skin. So this would be perfect for those that, you know, are not makeup freaks, I guess. Um, it's very lightweight, it doesn't feel cakey at all. Um, it lasts pretty much all day for me. And what else would I say? Oh, I love the fact that when I apply it, it kind of melts into my skin like my Chanel uh, foundation. So that is um, a plus for me. So this has been um, one of my favorite products. And pairing with that BB cream, I've been using my Sheer Cover concealer that I got from my My Glam bag um, a lot with it and I really really love it I have it on today it covers well my my um, dark circles and brines up where I need to you have a medium and a light shade and uh, it's been a lot of uh, a lot of fun using this um, next would be my this brush that I got from Sigma and it's their round top kabuki looks like this it's extremely dense I love using this brush with my Chanel bronzer bronze universal it's like a cream bronzer that I love like this and uh, it works extremely well I've been on a hunt for a, um, a good brush that would um, that would be perfect with with my um, Chanel bronzer and I think I found it this is really heaven for me um, next would be my um, these these color tattoo um, eyeshadow from Maybelline they're 24 hours I have two that I'm totally in love with the first one is tough as taupe which is their um, matte taupe color I love using this uh, with my um, MAC it's right here my MAC eyeshadow in satin taupe which is this color to create like that nice gray sm smoky eye and the other color that I love is this color in pomegranate punk which is this nice reddish color um, I love pairing this with my <coughs> my MAC eyeshadow in Glamour Check so 
so this has been my, my two favorite stuff that I that I've been using on my eyes. Um, the last thing would be nail polish. Um, someone asked me in my last video, my nail polish obsession, which top coat that I love. And usually I use the Sesh Feet uh, top coat because it's very, it dries very fast and it lasts, um, makes the polish last a long time. But it's kind of hard uh, to find it and I'm, I've been a little bit lazy to uh, order it online. So I found this um, top coat from Sally Hansen Insta Dry, um, which claims to dry your nails within like 60 seconds or something. And I am in love with it. it. I love how the brush is extremely thick. And it was super cheap. It was like $4, I think, at Walmart. And uh, I've used it yesterday before um, going to bed. And I swear my nails was super dry. And even like, you know, touch it and everything. You know, I had no problem with this. I wonder if it would actually... Um, keep my nail polish longer or it helps to um, prevent chipping but the dry the quick dry is um, is amazing with this one and it's very affordable um, two of my favorite nail polish this month have been from SC the first one is from their spring both of them are, are from their spring collection and it's the light purple that is called to buy or not to buy and on my Facebook, I have a picture of this nail polish on my nail, and I'm totally in love with it. The next color is Tour de Finance, and it's this hot pink that I have on my toes right now, and I'm super, super in love with it. I love anything hot pink like this. It's perfect for summer. And this product, I have kind of um, mixed feelings about it. Um, and it's my nail polish today that I, that is from Helly Hansen Smooth and Perfect Color Care Collection. And this one is in C, which is the mint green. Um, I love how, I love this color, hands down. I've been trying to find a nice mint green to uh, that goes well on my skin tone. Because green, I have problem with finding a good green because... Some green makes um, that are a little bit, um, I guess, greener, like a yellow base green, tend to make my skin tone very yellow and dull and not nice. But this is like a white base mint green, which enhance my tan and my skin tone a lot more. So that's why I love this color. The only thing that I don't like is how hard it is to apply. To have this color, I had to use almost like three to four coats of this nail polish. And at the end, it was kind of getting clumpy because I was like playing with it too much. Um, and this brush is like humongous. Really big. Um, but you know, if you don't mind applying like three or four coats of this, uh, and you're kind of like my skin tone, this color is amazing. And uh, I'm totally in love with it. It's just uh, how hard and, you know, time consuming it's, you know, that's the downside. But otherwise, the color is amazing. So that's pretty much it for my uh, favorites for this month. I hope you guys like it and um, would try some of these. Uh, let me know what's your favorite of this month and um send me some video response i'd love to see it and yeah so i'll see you guys very soon bye